coming here was like the best thing that could have ever happened to me in terms of my overall career. I feel like everyone here is committed to making sure that I leave this place a technically competent surgeon who's going to go out in the world and be great. This is a period of your life that will be relatively short, but if you do it right, will be one of the most fun periods of your life that you will have. We want our fellows to come here and to really be able to leave this program within two years, to have really good basic fundamental skills that will serve them well for the rest of their career. We are a very large mature cardiothoracic program that has been almost designed to train one fellow per year. The structure of the program is tailored to the fellowship applicant. We do over 1,700 heart cases per year, about 1,000 thoracic cases per year, so the opportunities for training are enormous. We've really embraced a lot of the new technology that's come out. We're all on board with doing robotic thoracic surgery. We're starting to do robotic bronchoscopic surgery, and we want our fellows to be trained in that. We have a very cohesive faculty group, people that are really having a good time working together, that are friends in and outside of the hospital. So I think for fellows to see that is really quite, quite unique. The UH experience is just, I, I think, a phenomenal experience for our fellows to be on the right side of the table. And if our fellows are not on the right side of the table for the majority of their cases, we're doing something wrong. At the beginning, it's overwhelming, right? But once you start to break it down, how, how am I going to put this patient safely on bypass? How will I protect the heart? And once you start to break those things down and understand that you can do them one at a time and you can do them well, uh, you, you, then you can do anything. My philosophy in teaching, which I think is shared by much of our faculty, is that every operative case is a fellow case. And now the fellow may not be able to perform the entire case, of course, but every case it should be assumed that the fellow is going to participate actively in as much part of the operation as they can from start to finish. Another aspect of this program that I think is really important for applicants to understand is the balance of the program, which I think is the best aspect of the program. Last week was my wedding anniversary, and I was able to go home and spend the afternoon with my wife. In the same week, in one shift, I was able to do an esophagectomy, a pneumonectomy, and a lung transplant. So that's something that all of us who are considering this fellowship and this career have to understand is what's your value system, what do you think is important to you, and does the training program offer that to you? We want that person to be a good human being. We want that person to leave this program and to be somebody that we're proud of. You're not gonna come here and be competing with a whole bunch of fellows. You're coming here and it is a wide open door. It's an open slate. Every day you pick the case that you wanna do. You decide what area of subspecialty you want to go in and we'll tailor that to you. It is an open book of a program. You have the breadth of experience across thoracic and cardiac to do whatever you want. They will leave here being a good, strong, competent surgeon, and I, I don't think that many other programs in the country can offer that. When I come to work in the morning, you know, certainly my focus is on uh, taking care of the patient, but my next focus is on how we, how we can train our fellow, and it's our job as attendings to facilitate that. With that wide variety of exposure with so many attendings and so few fellows, if you really want the chance to explore all of cardiothoracic, we offer a great fellowship. So I think everybody's trying to create an environment where their fellows are going to be well trained and go out into the world and do great things and make a great name for their program. This program just happens to be doing it really, really well right now. They're really providing great education, great hands-on experience, and hopefully they're making us into really great surgeons that are going to go out and do great things and make a good name for the program.